What's up world, RecMods here, back again with another video, and today, a new one for me, I'm gonna try to do like a newest video, and part of it, the first one's gonna be a little controversial, unfortunately, but I kinda wanted to do different gameplay styles, and or different gameplay, get different video styles, right? And so my first one, as you saw, was more of a live commentary, and this one I wanted to do a news one, and part of maybe giving a little bit of my opinion on the situation, trying to keep that out for the most part, uh, but just explaining why exactly some of the content I did recently was on the game that it was, right? So, as far as the news goes, it's in Apex Legends, right? And, and we're, they're doing the forced LTMs again. Uh, this was something that went big on the Apex Reddit and was a huge controversy across the Reddit for several days, if not the entire time, the entire duration that the two week long LTM went on. Now this was because the LTM was so bad. It was ring flares. It was one of the worst game modes ever. I played it. it was not fun in my opinion. This, I mean, it was just not a good idea. People hate the ring anyways and making people move out of positions that they didn't, it, it made it uncomfortable for a lot of people and it just wasn't a very fun game mode overall. It was almost like a gameplay change. I, you know, I really wish they would stop calling these LTMs because they're really not. You know, an LTM, let's be real, like a different game mode is like zombies. Like when they brought the zombie stuff in, that's a totally different mode. We're changing all different things. Little stuff like that is just like buffs, just gameplay changes, just minor gameplay changes that really shouldn't be considered a different mode, you know? It, it, there, if it was gold weapons, low gravity, this, that, and the other, you know, I would say, okay, maybe we're different here, you know, some map changes, that's a different game mode. And I really think they should separate this out to be more of, like, a totally different thing, but I guess they want to just categorize it in different modes, whatever, I get it. It's just, these are, these new ones, right? The new forced LTM, of course, isn't as bad. It's more of, honestly, in my opinion, actual game just minor minor gameplay changes so these are auto banner pickup shield regen stuff that was with watson already so really nothing new there's three hot zones high tier loot right stuff like that we've had all of that before you know so these these ltms are nothing new i i see that they're experience experimenting rather sorry with them and so I'm not as against to it this time, right? But I will say, for myself, I did actually stop playing Apex because of the last forced LTM. I don't think this is the right mentality, and I don't think this is the, the way to go about it. I understand that th this time around is a lot better, and I probably will play even if they introduce this, so that's totally fine, as long as they understand that minor gameplay changes like this are perfectly fine to pit in against you know uh and and do forced ltms but doing something major where it's changing everything you know I, I i don't know it's still a rough area right i just don't i just don't think it's the right mentality the right way to go but i'll leave i'll leave my my whole opinion out of it so i'll keep it as that you know it's just on, honestly that was the reason why i stopped playing apex honest and that and you see it in my content i made a fortnite video because i'm playing other brs there's really nothing else to play. I really wanted to play Apex, but I just couldn't. I, I couldn't stand it. So anyways, we'll look at some other pointers here. You know, people saying again, like I just said, the gameplay changes aren't that major. Uh, on the other side of things, you got people saying that this is more of like a... You get people saying on the other side of things, this is more of a playlist community beta test takeover. Yeah, I mean, it definitely could be represented that way. And we got a tweet. We'll pull up the tweet here with that boy Rito, he replies to play Apex, does this mean you're forcing us to play irritating LTMs again with no option to play, you know, the game we're here for? Play Apex responds, no, because you know, these are LTMs and not playlist takeovers. So that was cool at first, but reading back here, the Titanfall Twitter account with for Apex Legends News tweeted back and said uh are we missing something here and this image is of basically the little prompt at the bottom saying that this is going to be a takeover on tuesday for for uh, 13 and play apex then responds ah hey rito sorry they're takeovers again 
so you know overall it's not <laughs> you know it's unfortunate that apex got this wrong at the beginning and, and it almost like it almost looks like they were apologizing and being snarky about it and then when they came back afterward it's like they really apologized and then kind of fell back into oh ooh yeah i guess i guess we are forcing it and so that's a little weird i think that they they weren't up to speed on that and even you know, almost seems like they threw their somewhat opinion out there maybe they were just a little embarrassed to have gotten that wrong overall uh the other the other side of thing is why are you guys so mad the ltms aren't even that bad there's no need to be so dramatic just play ranked right and you know last time actually for rank they had heat shields in ranked and so it was very frustrating and the sound the, the whole bug sound thing was happening in ranked as well and that was unfortunate and I, I'll you know not to include my own opinion but I have a little bit of experience with this and you know, I've been in diamond uh, and occasionally so when I play for me diamond is so frustrating uh, just to, it's not, it's not as fun, right? It's really intense, don't get me wrong, but it's nowhere near as fun as pubs. So making me, you know, play ranked, a as opposed to that, well, you're just telling me to get on an alt, and I don't think that's the right approach. You know, telling players to leave the game, I really don't think is the right, you know, <laughs> the right, uh, the right approach to things. We have another Reddit post here that says, it'll be fine. I agree, I, I think it'll be okay. I don't think anything major is going to happen this time around. I don't think it's as bad as last time. You know, that's nothing terrible to me. I think it'll be okay. We have another tweet here. And this is just a super long tweet. I'm not going to read all this, but this is just about the takeover stuff and what it's about. And But we have a reply here that says, For me, the funniest part is, the funniest two parts are when he talks about healthy matchmaking. Yeah, it's so healthy. Nothing about healthy when you force an MM. God, I miss the good old times of just picking a server with, with a map and set up I enjoy. The second is even funnier, where he claims some people can't find or don't notice LTMs. Like, seriously? Seriously? People lost won't stay anyway, so how about stop catering to them? You know, for me, I think a lot of these games do cater to casuals, and that's just how it's going to be. <laughs> this person replied or on Reddit here. We got, I love it. I love how it went from this emote to this yeah real quick yeah that, that's what i mean so they were kind of embarrassed on that one huh another person says yeah i don't care making it forced probably provides them with an insane amount of information and feedback with experimental changes they might implement in the actual game making it better it's the reason i play apex over warzone who just does nothing to actually improve the br genre post release that's true you know i mean at least they're trying but Ah, uh, Warzone does have some good content, man. You you know, Apex and Warzone are kind of on the same level, to be honest. And really, Warzone sometimes comes out on top on that fight. Good to be honest with you. And I've been playing both, so that's just my opinion, though. And Fortnite definitely comes on top of everything. I mean, it just has the content for days. The map, no, right? But Fortnite has new store content, better better overall artists, in my opinion. Uh, but as far as you know content for map changes apex is on it they're the best for map changes and i think that's gonna wrap it up guys you know so for me i, I really well, i really didn't enjoy the ltm last time but this i don't think is going to be as bad this time around so i think we're 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 in for somewhat of an okay time in apex i've been back to playing it recently somewhat and I think I'll continue to play it on and off here and there. But I don't I don't think making people play other game modes or try other things is the right answer to this. And that's really unfortunate that Apex went this route and is forcing this stuff. But we'll see how it is, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. Let me know your opinions down below. Please feel free, debate, talk it out. This is a real controversial one in the gaming atmosphere and on Reddit. So who knows what's going to happen. All right, guys. I'll talk to you all later. Peace.